This is the semifinals here in Frisco, Texas. We have the Cameron Aggies taking on the Eastern New Mexico Greyhounds. Now, both teams are very familiar with one another, with both teams having a win against each other in the regular season. But now it's tournament time, so it's win or go home, and only one team will be able to go to that championship. It's the semifinals, and Cameron's still on their tournament run, not only looking to prove the doubters wrong, but prove themselves as they take on Eastern New Mexico for a chance at the trophy. Reggie Prudham in transition, finds Lavelle, Brightnex on the leak, and he throws it down to start the game, but I got a surprise for you. Prudham to Brightnex once again, and this time it's a no-look alley. Oop, we have action. Brightnex will be playing out of his mind, and he will go on a 6-0 run by himself to force a Greyhound time out. And Coach O'Connor doing what he does best, drawing up plays out of the timeout, though. Gregory Johnson takes matters into his own hands, pushing the pace in and out in transition, takes a long two and gets the bucket and the foul. Johnson will start making plays for the Greyhounds. Power dribbles down low, and you can add it up. It's 30 tight. Broadnex back in that mode, sizes up the defender and drives the lane for its 11th point in the first half. And now Andre Washington getting in on the action. Go to work, big man. He gets the and one bucket, but he will want more. Washington in the post with the fancy footwork, and he gets the tough layup, but that wouldn't be it. No, Prudham finds Washington in the high post off the pick and roll, and how do you do it? It's Washington again for the lay, but their effort wouldn't be enough to hold off the Greyhounds in the clutch as they lose 81-91. to 91.